Hello Internet World. Welcome, welcome to a new video on the Geekanoids channel. In today's video, I'm going to be giving you my review of the IMU Q2C. Uh, this is a really cool little home security camera and I can't wait to share my opinion with you. Uh, this is uh, really neatly packaged, first of all. This is the product box. Full disclosure, as always, the manufacturer sent me in this free of charge for this video. Uh, no money's changed hands and they haven't asked to pre-approve the video. I'm gonna share with you my opinion, how this has been working, and also show you what you get inside the box. So let's start off with a taking a look at what you get inside the box. So you get uh, the power cable. So this is a micro USB to full size USB. This is gonna go between the power adapter and the camera itself. So that's the first item you get inside the box. You also, of course, get a USB power adapter. Uh, I happen to be in the UK, so this is a three pin UK plug with USB on the bottom. If you buy this in another country, you should get a country specific power adapter inside the box. You also get a little sticky pad for if you want to stick this to a surface. Uh, you also get a little scratch to win card. Cool bonus, you could win uh, up to a £50 Amazon e-gift card. You also get a quick start guide. This is going to guide you through getting everything up and running. Goes through all of the features on the camera. You also just get some extra regulatory information. And then you get the camera itself and the main features on this uh, apart from really good 1080p full HD video is it does offer up night vision as well a 16 times digital zoom and also human detection so it's got some really good features the night vision on this is extremely good as well I've been really impressed with the quality that this picks up and the detail uh, during really dark scenes uh, we also get mobile alerts there is an app on the iOS app store or indeed the Google Android Play Store. So both platforms supported, and those apps allow you to get the um, uh, mobile alerts. It's got sound detection, uh, an alarm zone on it as well, an alarm schedule, so you can actually schedule this so that you've got periods of time where it won't uh, be activated and won't uh, sort of go off. Uh, also, a 108 degree field of view. It does human detection as well. Uh, and also a mix of uh, cloud storage, but also local storage as well. Uh, this is what a lot of uh, users are asking for, and in, indeed during my videos, a lot of uh, viewers ask for local storage as well as cloud storage. Uh, because if your internet goes down, of course you can't have cloud storage, but you can still record locally. And also if your uh, local storage uh, is full, for example, if your memory card's full, then of course you can still access the cloud storage. Uh, round on the back there's just a QR code, little speaker and also the reset and then underneath there you can see the micro USB connector for connecting this to power. Now you can rotate this and angle the camera, you can even put it completely flat like so, so you can get this, this is very slim line, so you can get this very very close uh, to a wall if you want to uh, or indeed as I would probably use this would just be stood on a uh, sort of a fireplace or a mantelpiece or a bookcase I would use it just on this little stand now one thing to note and again this is not a deal breaker uh, but just to know it is quite lightweight uh, so I found when I was plugging in via the cable uh, you, the cable comes down here uh, it did move the camera sometimes when I was adjusting the cable because the, ba the, the it's all right this being lightweight but the base has not got any weight in it uh, so I would have liked to have just seen a heavier base on this camera but again not a deal breaker because once it's in place once you've got it set up to the angle you want it then you're not going to worry about it moving around uh, it's just an, a nice overall package and very very good value for money now the quality of the video is extremely detailed, really good colour rendition, uh, nice amount of detail as well, good full HD 1080p video. Uh, during the daytime it is better video, 
then obviously at night time at night time it reverts to um, sort of infrared so you get the black and white sort of monochrome image but still a nice amount of detail a little tiny bit of noise maybe in the nighttime footage but still very very good definitely you can recognize people and you can pick out finer details but it does perform better during the daytime than at night time uh, so really good performance this is the IMU Q2C if you're in the market for like a, a compact uh, really nice little home security camera then this is well worth checking out so that's that's it for my review I hope you enjoyed it if you would like to pick up one of these for yourself then uh, look at the box very very cool box uh, if you want to pick up uh, one of these for yourself then please do check out the links down in the video description uh, also there's a link down there to the manufacturer's website so please do check that out as well uh, this has been a live broadcast so big thank you to all those of you tuned in live including Sumu Naf, first person in the live chat hello to you thanks for tuning in live got plenty of videos coming up uh, I often do this for those of you tuning all the way to the end I often give you a little bit of a sneak peek as to what's coming up on the channel so let's do that today in this video let's have a look what we've got coming up so we have got a really cool smartphone in fact I've got it just sitting over the back here this is a great value smartphone specced out really really good I've got a review of that coming out to uh, tomorrow that's the Infinix 08 oh that is a really good smartphone uh, also got a very cool uh, KVM switch uh, really very interesting actually uh, then latter part of this week uh, I have got a really good USB-C Gen 2 sharing switch so something a little bit different and a watch video coming up as well and then going into next week we've got some wireless earbuds uh, we have got a look something that you've been asking for for a long long time so next week do tune in a lot of you asking for a, uh, a video about the overhead camera setup here uh, I will include some details about the lights as well uh, but a lot of you asking how this works I've got that video coming up uh, next week as well uh, thank you again for tuning in everyone if you're not already subscribed please do hit that subscribe button and the notification bell and if you enjoyed this video please do hit the like button share a link to the video as well all that good stuff and uh, drop me some comments below if you've got any questions at all about this product or technology in general uh, thanks for watching everyone I'll see you in another video very, very soon.